Day 6, The Mind, 1 Corinthians chapter 2, verse 16, the ESV. For who has understood the mind of the Lord so as to instruct him? But we have the mind of Christ. Over the last five days, we have been confessing about the mind and we have dimensioned it into various areas of our lives. But today we are going to confess about the mind of Christ as it relates to our gifts in Christ Jesus. Now in 2 Timothy chapter 1 and specifically in verse 6, Paul was admonishing Timothy, asking him to rekindle the embers of or fan the flame of or keep burning the gracious gift of God that is on his inside. And in verse 7, he said, For God did not give us a spirit of timidity, of cowardice, of craven and cringing and fawning fear, but he has given us a spirit of power and of love and of calm and well-balanced mind and discipline and self-control. Another version says that he should keep that gifts keep it ablaze for God doesn't want us to be shy with his gifts but to be bold and loving and sensible daughter of God woman of God you are bold and you are loving and you are sensible with your gift you are not shy with your gift you are audacious the Bible says that the righteous are as bold as a lion you are as bold as a lion with your gift you are not afraid to express your gift you do not walk in fear your gift could be in the ministry or in the marketplace but you have the spirit of power you are enabled you are empowered to do that which God has called you to do on the face of the earth you have a calm and well balanced mind because you have the mind of Christ you have discipline because you have the mind of Christ. Somebody defined discipline as giving yourself orders and being able to obey it. You have the mind of Christ. You are disciplined and you have self-control. You have self-control over your emotions. You do not get emotional over issues. You are one, a woman that has the mind of Christ. You are well disciplined. You are well measured. You are well measured in everything that you do. You know when to speak and when not to speak. You know when to be mute and when not to be mute. Hallelujah. You have the mind of Christ. Come on, go ahead and say it. I have the mind of Christ. I function with the mind of Christ. I function in the power of the mind of Christ. I have the spirit of power, not of fear. I have the spirit of power, not of fear. I have the spirit of a sound mind. I have a sound mind. I have have love, I have calm, I am well balanced, I have a well balanced mind, I have the mind of Christ, I am able to do all things that Christ puts in front of me, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me, amen, hallelujah, go ahead and win again today.